Let's get to breaking news near Seattle's Cal Anderson Park. Seattle police say a homicide suspect who barricaded himself inside a nearby building all night has been found dead. This all comes after officers discovered a woman's body in the park. King 5's Kelly Greenberg is live now with the latest details. Kelly, good morning. Good morning. So at Cal Anderson Park, police say they entered the building around 1230 this morning to find that man dead. This was a Seattle Public's utility utilities building. Essentially, it was a pump station. And what authorities are saying is that this individual was found at the bottom of a tank with a bleach solution in it. So they did have to call a hazmat team to assist the coroner. Now, this is video taken from last night as this uh, barricaded situation was going on. Police, as I mentioned, did call in a hazmat crew. Now, it was last night that police responded around 8 o'clock when they found the Seattle Fire Department doing CPR on a woman at Cal Anderson Park. That woman later died and is believed to be in some kind of relationship with the man who barricaded himself. Now, police are calling this a domestic violence homicide. They say the two people were likely living in some kind of shelter together. Seattle Fire did attempt life-saving measures on this woman, but the authorities say that she died at the park. And then it was shortly after that they got a call that this individual was barricaded inside of the Seattle Public's utility building. Again, this was around 8 o'clock last night, so this was a long situation between this individual and authorities. They ended up calling in the SWAT team and negotiators, but as I mentioned, what happened, they entered the building around 1230 this morning to find that man deceased. Now, Cal Anderson Park has been closed since late June, so a reminder to avoid the area as police continue to do their job. Live in Seattle, Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.